Miss Finney has never hidden his admiration for Tanzania, a country where he lived and studied. And in the aftermath of the 00 stalemate in Kampala between Cranes and the Stars in September, he noted that the result was good because both countries are his homes. Few for President Moses Magoga reiterated the Federation's appreciation for support from the government and highlighted how key interventions, like the chartered flight to Maseru, had gone a long way in securing the latest qualification. Uganda is the only country in the whole of Africa to have qualified without conceding a goal, an achievement which would not have been possible without government's increased funding for the national team and the federation, Magogo observed. The FUFA president then handed Musvin I the FUFA Goal Award for his contribution to development of the game in Uganda. It is the highest honor in the hierarchy of football awards in the country. Musvin I broke the room in laughter when he demanded to know why the team wasn't hitting in Yanda hard shot. I watched you in Gabon and didn't see in Yanda. You must start aiming from far to get good results. It is at this point that Magogo told him that three of Uganda's seven goals had been hard shots, all coming in the home and away wins against Lesotho. Musvin I lectured the small team of Cranes players on the key components skill, stamina and teamwork. He later on requested to have an exclusive word with the four Cranes players. He reportedly told them that he would be instructing his team to wire bonuses to their accounts. More money. He later on requested to have an exclusive word with the four Cranes players. He reportedly told them that he would be instructing his team to wire bonuses to their accounts.